What's up guys? Welcome to the vlog, it's Reed. We're in New York City still. Today is day three, August 15th. So you know what that means. Only three days till Kasai Pro 3. I cannot wait for it. As every day goes by, I get more excited, more amped for this big competition. And today's gonna be a fun day, I promise. Today's gonna be a good one, man. I'm going to Unity Jiu Jitsu. Of course, everybody knows about Unity Jiu Jitsu. Marillo Santana, the Meow Brothers, uh, uh, Devante Johnson, and of course, Juni Okazio is going to be preparing for his super fight on Kasai Pro 3 versus Ethan Krenlinston. I cannot wait for it. Let's go check it out and see what they have in store. Already. Six rounds of drilling in the books. Now we're going to do seven rounds of, uh, of sparring. And if I'm being honest with you, I'm going to die. I'm going to get beat up. I got Devontae, I got Paolo, I got a bunch of other guys who are killers. So tune in to watch me get beat up. It should be fun. For you, not for me. Down. I honestly feel like I'm gonna puke in a second right now. But Merlo just called me over, so I'm gonna go do that. So we're at Unity Jiu Jitsu, uh, where I train and instruct that. Pretty much, they're just for me regular training, uh, but you know, it's more geared towards this weekend, so we're about like, I think, three days out. Uh, we're going to fight a Kasai, uh, uh, opening for the main card uh, against Ethan Pellis. I think it's a good matchup. I think it's, uh, we're, we're totally different fighters at this stage in our career, and I think, I think it's going to be very explosive. There's not going to be no stalling because there's only six minutes. 
and it's points and sub only. I think it's the perfect rule set to me to meet it. I don't want to say he's not a point fighter, but he, he's going for the finish. He's explosive, but I think he's he's dangerous. Uh, you can expect an explosive match. Uh, I don't think you can put me in a match to stall. I'm going to play my game, impose my will, but um, I'm, I'm going to be in his face. There's no backing up for me. Do whatever it has to take to win and uh, show why everybody I'm supposed to be in the main card. He's very good in stand in the bottom and on top. He's very dangerous in the hook attacks, like lock attacks. And he, he, he pass very well too. And on bottom, he has like, a lot of good sweeps. I think he's gonna do very well. He is prepared and he's ready. And I, I am sure he's gonna do very well. So for Juni, like, uh, he's actually interesting because he's a little guy, but he has like a lot of pressure with that relentless pace that a little guy has. For me, it's unusual to like find a little guy with that much yeah. pressure and then that much speed and technique to match it up. So he's very like different from most of the little guys that I roll with. So he's very, and he does not stop moving. You know, I, I anticipate a lot of pressure passing, you know, a lot of just really going aggressive and, you know, kind of like balls to the wall like he always does, you know, to get the finish. And, you know, Ethan uh, doing what he does best, attacking from the bottom and, you know, putting on a crazy s series of submission hunts. Uh, I want to watch Craig Jones and Pagliari, I want to watch the Grand Prix too, it will be a lot of fun. <laughs> I don't really know how that match is going to go, um, I mean I hope Craig has health insurance. <laughs> <laughs> you know, just, if he lets him up our higher scrap, it's like, God, you know, like, I guess, I don't think he understands stop, no matter what language it is, so, you know, hopefully, for Craig, he goes up there and, you know, does his thing, you know, but I think it's going to be interesting match for us. That's one thing, like, maybe Rusimar doesn't let go of the submissions, but he definitely puts on a show when he's out there. I think the whole card for Kasai is just insane. They definitely know how to put on the card. The whole undercard is nothing but the top tier competitors. Uh, around here. Um, I'm just excited to see everybody fight in, in the Kasai rule set, which is honestly, besides the time frame, is my favorite rule set because, uh, you know, kind of mixes the two worlds. You know, every, you get to have all your subs, and I get my point system without advantages. Nobody likes advantages. That was awesome. Incredible training session. Yeah, got to roll Murillo at the end. Oh my god. Murillo is amazing. Definitely by far one of the best guys I've ever rolled with. I just couldn't do anything to him. Made me feel like I didn't even know Jiu Jitsu. Apart from the course. But I told him that I might puke. And he said, ah, don't worry about it, just run to the bathroom, puke, and come right back. All I want to do is jump in a cold shower right now. I, I can see why those guys in between rounds jump in showers. That's all I want to do right now, is just jump in a cold shower. Alright, alright.